so skeptic. Okay, I see you. Thinking about it. Okay, waiting for a message. You're saying here that you're in control now. You rejected them. Now they're just ignoring you, holding back on communication, trying to show to you like, oh, I'm having fun, whatever. You know, I'm seeing friends. I post social media. I'm out and about. Trying to get you to have, trying to get a reaction from you, Pisces. Ooh, okay. Spicy. What is this? Lying? Okay, <laughs> spicy lie. Okay. So I feel like this is some sort of um, Masman curry because it's, is, is it spicy also? <laughs> because your person is trying to get some sort of, like, make you feel jealous. Oh, okay, Pisces. All right, I see your person. We're gonna go for your side and your person's side. All right. Tarot and Oracle. Okay. Uh, so you're distancing yourself because every time you try to make a move, uh, well, not make a move, every time you try to m build something with this person, it just leads to a pandemonium. Ooh, someone read something today. Pandemonium, like Panda Express, not sponsored. Like, yeah, it's just wild, it's just crazy. It's like I'm dealing with the crazy. Well, if you're in love with the crazy, when that does not, what does that make you? Well, mental. So, <laughs> I'm not making fun of people, but you know you. When we're in love, I mean, people who are, who are diagnosed, make it seem like they're normal, right? <laughs> because you go crazy. That's why the song, you drive me crazy. Mm -hmm. So then you scratch your head over here and it's like, why am I doing this to myself? I need to find, because <laughs> we have a saying here, like what you need is, you know, one as an ascendant master to save you. <laughs> mm. You need someone to intervene here. And then you find that courage to say, it's like, you know what? I'm not, I'm not going to do this anymore. So you rejected them. Okay. So the Piscean are saying, yes, I learned the hard way. I was in love. I gave it all. I was used, abused, and all those stuff, Sal. But not anymore. Not anymore. I said no for the first time. Four of Cups. Hermit over here. You know, you isolated yourself. Ooh, look at that. Who's grumpy? Someone's grumpy. Not you. Them. Emperor. You know, Aqua was dealing with the same. Somewhat similar. Someone is trying to control them. Okay. And then here, Nine of Pentacles, like, no, I am independent from this person. I felt divorced, separated, goodbye, no. Okay. Well, that's the nature of masculine energy. Like, they control and then, you know, like in olden times, you know, women do submit. Right? Well, that was before, right? That was two days ago, Sal, so, when we <laughs> two days. <laughs> Not anymore, Sal. So. No, no, no. It was centuries, eons ago. You know, I mean, even it's called mother nature. So <laughs> I never heard of someone caring that, you know, is a masculine, not at all. Father nature <laughs> doesn't work. So you cared, you nurtured this person. And now you're saying, I'm done with that. Uh -uh. No, because you have here the empress. When you give, you give, you love, you love. And look at this emperor and the empress. So that's a separation right there. Right? So you're looking at a different side. You're ignoring them. Empress and the devil. So you're claiming to this person, like, goodbye. No, no, no. Stop. You know, I'm not going to tolerate this. And look at that. You remember how they hold back, held back from you, Ace of Pentacles? That's them holding back. You have a Six of Cups over here and the Six of Wands. Uh, Nine of Cups and the Six of Wands. Someone's trying to reach out. Now, your person is trying to get attention from every little thing, okay? They're going to pose. This is Nine of Cups. The Nine of Cups is a poser of like, oh, I'm happy, I'm good, you know? With a devil card, that's a poser. So this is more of like intention, okay? So they may be posting things so that, you know, you will react from them, Okay. Knight of Wands with the Six of Wands over here. I'm seeing right now that, you know, in this situation, um, your person will approach you, and the Knight of Wands is also like, I'm trying to be fresh with you. Okay. Okay. Let's see your oracle. So your person is like, um, I don't know if you're familiar, you know, with coconut. Uh, so coconut, we call it buko. And in, in my country, we always say fresh buko. So your person is like a fresh coconut. 
fresh coconut. Present is stubborn. Mm -mm. The supreme collection awaits you, available in a variety of captivating styles. Emerald, a symbol of renewal and prosperity. Aquamarine, calmness, clarity, and enhances communication. Rose quartz, nurtures your heart and promotes self-care. Black rutilitated quartz, ground your energy and amplifies positive intentions. Moonstone, enhances intuition, harmony, and emotional balance. Tiger's eye, empowers you with strength, confidence, and courage. The Supreme Collection, elevate yourself one crystal at a time. I have a funny story about the coconut. We have a housekeeper. A coconut hit her. <laughs> Growing up, it was a nanny. Okay. You're, per you're, you're right now ignoring this person, Pisces. Like, whatever. You see? You're just in the whatever mode. I could care less. Hmm. You, they're not going to get a response. Um, Your person is claiming here is like, you know where to reach me. If you want to text, you want to call, you want to have a conversation, call me. So they're leaving things behind. Like, and they're giving you mixed signals here. You see, mm, mixed signals, different kinds of messages so that you will get confused. Mm. Okay, mm -mm -mm. let's get the next 30 days. All right, let's get that first. Okay, is this the same deck? Okay, number two, number one. Okay, so it could be connected with a Sag, a Virgo, an Aries. You also have a Capricorn. Then you have a Taurus and a Libra. Next 30 days, please, right here. Okay. You have your... Okay. Your foreseeable future. Ah, best course of action in our foreseeable future, right here. Okay. Let me see here. Okay. And the foreseeable future. Okay, now I'm going to use this. Okay. Let's see. Oh, the star. Well, someone realized uh, their value. The star and the Three of Swords, the full card. Can I be honest and candid? I feel like love is overrated. I mean, yes, there, I said it. Love is canceled for 2023. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's not cancelled is our amazing elevated bracelet. That's just got elevated. Okay. So you can check it out in the description box below, of course. I'm wearing the aquamarine. So go check it out. Handmade, of course. Now, why do you need to elevate? Well, this is the reason why you attract this peasants. Because your energy is not that it's peasant. Okay. It's still reachable Pisces by peasants. The devil is clingy, right? So I would recommend black spinal obsidian, especially if you're dealing with a karmic connection, to cut the mother's son of a... Mm -hmm. Tourmaline the mother, not the pink tourmaline, you gotta go all black on this one, okay? All black crystals. The the darkest, better, all right? I don't think there's ever a darker than black, all right? What else? Black tourmaline, obsidian, you can't, you can't do no moonstones for you, no how light, no, no, no. Darker, more masculine, you have more power and more control. Did you see Maleficent, what she's wearing? She's full of control and she's full of darkness. I want you to embody that, okay? <laughs> I'm kidding. Because the star card, oh, I'm a Pisces. I'm a vulnerable person. I love... Ah, hush. That's why you get treated like this, three of swords, okay? I can't have you being a Nemo when you're freaking swimming here in the Pacific Ocean. You need to be the Jaws over here, Pisces. The full card is just like, well, can I give them a chance? How many chances? I need you to be a piranha when I need you to be a piranha, okay? You can't be no goldfish. You know what happened to goldfish? You know where they swim after 30 days? It's not a good sight. <laughs> it just goes around and around, and then they say it went to the farm. I ask my parents, why the farm when it's a fish? <laughs> Do you want yourself here, three of swords dead? No. Do you want to be, oh, well, but I'm in love. <laughs> And love, go back and study something, get a PhD and master's, be productive about your life. But I mean, love, no, no. King of Cups is Scorpio manipulating it. Two of Cups tells you all the good things. But I'm, no. 
<laughs> That's how I deal with clients. I ask, are you in love? Okay, we stop there. This session is over. I need you to go out there, start working out, do your yoga, your meditation. But what about love? Yes, that if you love yourself, you do that. Yeah. Good? Okay. You come back after the 30 days when you start loving yourself. Then I ask you again, do you, so you stay in love? No, I love myself now. Good. We stay that. Elevated, you know, bracelet. That gives you that empowerment. Mm-hmm. Guaranteed. <laughs> if you work on yourself. It's okay. I see you're going to forgive this person regardless of what I told you. Three of swords. Because you're here, right? Mm. You want to reconcile, right? Mm, three of swords. I did another reading. The Pisces was getting someone new. The full court. But what if? Okay, I give you the what if, Pisces. The devil here also. I give you the devil. Here we go. The codependent relationship has been using you. Well, they say we're soulmates. Two of cups. Okay. Mm, let's see if you guys are going to come back together. Tough love for the Pisces. Or else I will never be able to see you again. I never see my Pisces ever. <laughs> okay. Cards uh, focus right here. Mm -hmm. So there's going to be reconciliation that you're trying to figure out. You might take a chance on that. They have betrayed you so many times. Two of cups over here. You guys still love each other. Okay, here we go. You have a next 30 days here. Um, best, uh, best course of action. And of course, the foreseeable future. Everything is in the description box below for the extended reading. Let's see. Okay, your card of focus is like, maybe it's going to work out. Three of coins. So maybe, maybe if I talk to them. If you talk to them, that would be the last time I see you. <laughs> because your person will cling to you like a devil. Mm-hmm. Right there. Well, I just need to hear it. Well, sometimes you don't. Sometimes you can really turn yourself back around from this kind of toxic behavior. But I see that you want to cooperate and you want to work things out. I'm not going to take that away from you. I will continue this link in the description box below for the extended reading. If it's going to work out, we'll see. Bye.